Hi, welcome back. We will be using my fruit to help us get started with our new addition unit. But first, let me pour myself something to drink and I'll meet you at my desk. lemons do you see? Three. Can you set out three counters in front of you? And how many watermelon slices do you see? Four. Can you set out four counters as well? Great. Now let's add them all together or let's count them up. How many counters or fruit do we have? Let's count together. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Did you have seven too? Three and four make seven. Now let's do it again. Let's clean up our counters. And instead of lemons, I'm going to use some eggs and strawberries. Okay, I'm going to set out my eggs. Let's do this many. And some strawberries. Let's do three. How many eggs do I have? One, two, three, four, five is right. Can you set out five counters? And now, how many strawberries are there? You got it. One, two, three. Can you set out three counters at home? So, we have five and three. Let's push them all together and count how many there are. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I had five eggs and I added three strawberries to my pile. Now I have eight all together. Do you see how I made up a story? Can you tell your teacher a story using the same counters we just used? And then your teacher can tell you a story using the counters we use. Now let's clean up our counters and we'll make a new story. So I'll put away my egg so they don't fall off the table and I'll move my strawberries. This time I'm going to draw a circle on my table. So here's my circle. And here's my addition story. Let's pretend this is my basket. I have some lemons in my basket. Is my basket too small? Can you count how many lemons I have? One, two, three, four, five lemons. Can you set out five counters in front of you now? Good. I went to the store and I put five lemons in my basket. But then I decided I want some strawberries too. So I added two more strawberries in my teeny tiny basket. <laughs> ah, have you ever had fruit, fruit fall out? Now, how many pieces of fruit do I have all together in my basket? I had five and I added two more. So this time, let's put five in our head and let's count on two more. Five, six, seven. I have seven pieces of fruit in my teeny tiny basket. Now, can you tell your teacher a story using the numbers we just used? And then your teacher can tell you a different number story. 
Now before we go, I set out some of my special counters to give you a challenge. What I want you to do is with you and your teacher, look at my counters and see if you can come up with as many different addition stories as you can. I wonder how creative you'll be. Most of all, have fun. Bye, see you next time.